Y'all ready to shuffle? Yeah. Look at all the colors I got. Ooh. Look at all they rock when I pull up in the spot. Yeah, yeah I got the jams. I make uh. the sound and they throw all their hands. I'm living in colors, so when me and all the others, all I wanna do is dance. Beach can shuffle? Um, no comment. Is Abish uh, hip hop enough? Mm. Think about Abish's dance. Mm, all right. The best part about him was that he was not scared. He was not shy while dancing. He was just into himself. He was dancing his heart out. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your host for the evening is a very funny, very charming, and very handsome man. Best friend, Abish Matthew. Thank you so much. Welcome back to Son of a Beach. This is my version of a late night talk show, which, by the way, you can watch it anytime. Depends on when I upload it. So it's not literally night, but hopefully it's night. We've got a great show lined up for you. We've got two amazing guests in the house. We've got Divine and we've got Raja Kumari in the house. What? Ah. But it's time for us to take a look at what's happening around in the world in a segment I like to call In Other News. In Other News. A couple was caught having sex inside a Domino's outlet. The court promised to give the verdict in 30 minutes or free. <laughs> Reports say that it was the first time a delivery was delayed by nine months. Okay guys, to be very honest, um, I think these are just food puns that we're doing, right? You're like, where is the thought behind this joke? But these are food puns and we're proud of it. So I think we should own up. And so presenting to you another segment, it's called Sex Pizza Puns. All right, here we go. Hey, I am glad they didn't have sex at Papa John's because then Mama John's will deliver a Lil John. Yeah, yeah, what up? Finally, Domino's made a pizza that everyone can enjoy with pepperoni, pepperoni, areola, areola, pepperoni, pepperoni, meatball. And finally, Hey man, did you pull out before your cheese burst? <laughs> In other news, a man was arrested for trying to steal a cop car with cops inside it. <laughs> this was the first time that cops were at a crime scene on time. <laughs> Though, in related news, in Delhi, somebody had stolen Kejriwal's blue Wagonar. <laughs> right? The culprit said, Sorry, I thought you were my Uber, yaar. Sorry, I thought... <laughs> Main trip karke bej deta, bol deta aap. In other news, in the US, a library book was returned after 78 years. When is the last time you visited a library, by the way? You, you know libraries, right? Yeah. Where you get photocopies. <laughs> you know libraries, you know, the trend set of our glasses. You know, you, you know libraries. The location used by Bollywood movies to establish nerdy nature of the heroine. And the only library this generation knows of is the iTunes library. The only time I've seen a librarian at work is at Pornhub. <laughs> After receiving the book 78 years later, the librarian got really mad and started shouting, saying, this place is so bad. In other news, a man dressed as a Coke bottle robbed a restaurant because apparently even while robbing, people prefer Coke over Pepsi. The cops apprehended the criminal by yelling, Don't move or I will mentos you! After five hours of high-pressure interrogation, the robber finally opened up and said, Psss. 
You're laughing at this with me. We're all at the same level right now. <laughs> Given the coke's color, I am surprised that the American cops didn't shoot it. Because if it was Fanta, they would elect it. <laughs> yes! 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 We made it! We made it through the end of the monologue! And now, for no reason at all, unnecessary rhymes. Your marriage is falling down, falling down, falling down. Your marriage is falling down, but it's stuck because you had a baby unplanned. Oh. Our first guest is a Grammy nominated artist who's well versed in not just one, two, but three forms of classical dancing. Yep, she's coming here to make us all feel shit about our lack of talent. Our second guest comes here straight from the streets of Mumbai, bringing him with him with his infectious energy and raw talent, a rapper with the voice of the young India behind him. I'm glad Meri Gali Mein. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for none other than Divine and Raja Kumari! <laughs> Thank you so much for coming. Yes, uh, man, I want to actually start off with you. Um, okay. You were born and raised in California, mm -hmm. in LA. Los Angeles. And, yeah, Los Angeles. And West spent side. West Side, right? Is this a sign for West Side? This, no, no, this, this. Not this. No, no, this, this. That's like, <laughs> you have to cross the middle ones. There you go. Oh, you this go. is West Side. Yeah, yeah, that's the West what Side. What is East Side? I think, what's East Side? Is, I don't even know. I don't know East Side. I'm only from the West. I don't oh, know. Oh, kick it out. And you know what? This is Mumbai. Oh, yeah. I like that right. one. I like that Can one. this be Mumbai? Yeah. Oh. Mumbai side. Like, you had Dr. Dre outside the house and Dr. Dad inside the yeah, house. Yeah, that's Your true. dad is a doctor, mm. much like every Indian there. Typical, um, yes. And yeah. you were a rebel Indian kid, much like every Indian kid yeah. there. <laughs> How did you make that transition to convince your parents, right, this is what I want to do, because every Indian child needs that approval? Um, you know, they, they were not the happiest in the beginning. They were concerned that I didn't want to do medicine like everyone else in the family. But uh, I think as people uh, really reacted to me performing and saying that they, you know, they really loved the music, they let me keep going. But definitely when I met A.R. Rehman, they were like, OK, you're good now. You've got the seal of approval. We'll let you do music. So one photograph changed Yeah, just one life. photograph changed everything. Before that, they'd be like, come home. What are you doing? And then after A.R., they were like, Go to the studio. You can you can hang out there as long as you How'd want. How do you get to meet Aaron A friend of a friend. I I like manifested him into life. I had a photo of him on my uh, vision board, and I just kept asking every single person, like, if you know him, let me meet him, because no one in LA is asking. Well, people are, but not as many you yeah. would think. So anytime I walked into any room, I'm like, do you know Ar Rahman? And uh, one friend was just in town, and he's like, he's here for a day. You have to come right now. And I just showed up at his house. <laughs> Outside, took off my shoes and just saw him. And I was like, oh my God, he's here. But it's been incredible. Ever since I met him, he's been like a mentor to me. And just, it's crazy to go from like being obsessed with someone to just having regular conversations with them about like South Indian food. About South Indian food? Yeah, like eating with your hand, eating dadojanam and like making Telugu jokes. Like. So you ask everybody if you know A.R. Rahman. Mm. That must have been a really weird Tinder dates for you. <laughs> like, my name is John. Do you know A.R. Rahman? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> you know, I'm a... Pretty much. That's like yeah, really how it went down, yeah. So you, you went to his house, you took off shoes. Yeah, everybody. Is that like a carpeting yeah. thing or? All the shoes are outside. Oh, everyone's shoes everyone's are outside. Everyone's shoes are outside. So when you saw him for the first time? I just was like, he's real. And he's just this little guy. He's real cute, sweet, really nice, you know. <laughs> like you're describing me a little yeah, bit. Yeah, you know. <laughs> he was just really sweet and... Uh, it's just crazy, like, when he starts speaking, it's like that voice that you're used to hearing with him singing, like, Dilse, and then, like, he's talking to you with that same voice, so. Like, so, like, how are you? Yeah, it was pretty much. It was, it was pretty close to that. I mean, my mom had, like, said, she, like, even though it was, like, a three-hour time period between me finding mm -hmm. out I was going to house, his house and going there, she already found a way to send sweets with me. Oh, nice. Yeah, so That's I came in bearing Indian gifts. Indian family abroad? Kana to Beijing she tried to send sweets for Lil Wayne once too. What? Yeah, it happened. Did Lil Wayne eat it? Like, yeah. yeah. No, he ate. He ate the um, the cashew. Like she made like cashew brittle, and he ate it. Man, when your video came out, I was just like, it looks amazing. 
and it sounds amazing. Yeah. I want to collaborate with this guy. <laughs> Isse mere views <laughs> I was just like, how can I sell for But the song was so good, and then the video apparently was shot over five days. Yeah, four days. Four chaar, days? Yeah, four days. shoot kiya tha. See, gorilla shoot, uh, JD, my friend, he shot kiya tha. Huh. हुक and i told nazi that i have this ready let's get on it and he was like yeah let's do it and then we made the video it was all ready uh, we performed it at blue frog sony music was there they took the song and then they, they released the song so uh, the promo was not matlab hum log khali label pe aa gaya gana do mera oh <laughs> label pe gana ja raha hai tum log ne aise hi gana de diya aur but it did very good yeah it did really well how many of you have heard gali uh, meri gali mein here <laughs> गलत गाना है वो ऐसा नहीं जाता है ये तुम लोग अमीर पब्लिक है ना इसके लिए लगते हैं कोई किसी ने सुनाया कि नहीं मेरे गली में आप सुना रहे हैं ना तेरे शूटर होगा खास मेरे गली में नाइस वेल डन आई प्राउड ऑफ यू आई प्राउड ऑफ यू आई हर्ड इट इन एलए आई मीन दैट दैट सॉन्ग ट्रैवल्ड ऑल द वे दैट्स द रीजन आई वांटेड टू कोलैबोरेट विद हिम हाउ डिड यू गेट टू नो अबाउट इट बिकॉज़ हु शेयर्ड इट विद यू दो आई आई लाइक फाउंड इट आई थिंक आई सॉ ये मेरा बॉम्बे फर्स्ट एंड आई लाइक हिट हिम ऑन ट्विटर आई एम लाइक हे एंड देन ही डिडंट रिस्पॉन्ड टू मी एंड देन आई हिट हिम अगेन फ्रॉम मेरी गली में राजा कुमारी अभी मैं बोला कि कौन है तेरा राजा कुमारी या मेरे को लगा कोई ऐसे मतलब ऐसे टाइम पास प्रोफाइल है या बट देन टाइम पास आई होप यू स्पोकन एंड फिक्स दिस नो नो आई मीन बट वी इवन मेट ओवर द इंटरनेट लाइक बिकॉज़ ऑफ द म्यूजिक एंड वी कोलैबोरेटेड लाइक दैट एज़ वेल नो देन शी सेंड हर म्यूजिक एंड आई वाज ब्लोन ये लाइक ये लेजिट राजकुमार दिस पर्सन इज अ म्यूजिशियन नहीं फिर मेरे को समझ में आया इतना नाम राजकुमारी है क्योंकि ये Which reminds me, Raju Kumari is a stage name, and Divine is a stage name. You know, they have real names also. Yeah. <laughs> they have <laughs> last names. names. Yeah. Yeah. Which, uh, which is what I want to get to. Yes. So, for example, you told me yesterday that um, my middle name has 13 letters in it. What? Okay, no, you're not telling me this. But let's break it down. So, your name is Shweta. Shweta Yella Pregada Rao. <laughs> yes, I'm Telugu. Yes, it's true. <laughs> uh, what's a, what's a, when did the what's the last name? Oh Rao I got oh, to go okay, in America okay. I got Rao that okay. helped me but like you would then they try to say it in school they'd be like Svita Yala it's me it's me don't worry it's don't me don't even attempt just leave it there Rao Miss Rao What's your middle name again Yella Pragada Yella Pragada Yeah you, you got know, it in Mal- in Kerala you you put your family name right you know your house name in the yeah. middle So example my name should my name is Abish George Matthew it should have been Abish Chettukundel Matthew Mathai I wish that was your Chetukunel. name. Chetukunel. That's right. Chetukunel. I love that. South Indian. Do you? You have. Uh, no. He has a. He Vivian has. Vivian Fernandez. You have Vivian Fernandez. Okay, yeah. great. So that's. Yeah. So now that we've explained, uh, why did the name Raju Kumari come through? Well, um, I always had Kumari attached to my name. Like when I was a child, they called me Kumari Swetha Rao, USA. Like when I came and danced in India, like all the places would say that. Mm-hmm. So I always liked that that word. And then um, in high school, I would be like in those very standard like. ciphers that you see in like the tv shows oh, and ciphers does anyone know what ciphers you guys are? know what a cipher is i don't know that's why i'm blaming it so on you so it's a ra- what is a cipher <laughs> like is it a guy who wears a hoodie and hacks <laughs> computers my name is cipher <laughs> no like a rap cipher where like a bunch of people are standing in a circle during lunch break and we're all just freestyling and you know there's somebody beatboxing it's like very classic hip hop and i would all the all the rappers would always call me indian princess oh. so i was like okay i like that but they would call me ip And I was like, I was young, obviously, so I was like, I P U P. We all P. Like this is a very strange name. I don't know if I can go with this. So I was um, obviously I studied classical dance, and I had this obsession with the Mahabharat and Sanskrit. So I was like Raja Kumari, and that was the name. Yeah, I mean, it was born. That's how we came up with Raja Kumari. Yeah, it just it arrived. It's, it's not one name, right? No, it's two names. It's Raja Kumari. I just thought it'd be cool to be called Raja, so they don't know if it's a girl or a boy coming in. It's someone aggressive. That's all they know. <laughs> you're an M- if you're an MC, you kind of have to have that persona. MC, not not the one that you're thinking. <laughs> what is what else is MC? <laughs> <laughs> no. I don't know. I'm being real. <laughs> you haven't clearly been in Bombay for long enough. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, 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 no. All right. So divine. Exa- you have um. Uh, so Zoya Akhtar has 
uh, is making a movie with Ranveer Singh at the helm of it, yeah. uh, which is inspired, uh, loosely inspired by your story. Yeah, it's inspired from the whole scene, uh, obviously. And the movie is being made, where has it reached from the gully? And Zoya, has, she's, chilling with, she's chilled with me a couple times. I chilled with Ranveer a couple times. Nice. So, both are very excited and Ranveer, uh, like he's the best out right now, hands right, down. Yeah, yeah, I, you said excited Ranveer, is there any other variation of Ranveer <laughs> <laughs> that we know of? I doubt it. Have you seen Ranveer in any other form other than, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> tuck, tuck, tuck. This is all for caffeine shots, by the way. Caffeine shots. He's saying, he's my friend. Yeah, he's your friend. He's like crime share. Karte. So, <laughs> You will share the group, we will share lawyers. Share karte. So, <laughs> you made Gully cool, bro. <laughs> Ek Delhi se ho. So, Delhi mein Gully had a different context. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Gully is something you avoid if you want to live. <laughs> Bombay, mein Gully was always cool. Yeah. And now you made it cooler. Yeah, now it's a hip hop festival for dance. Ke liye. Correct. Yeah. Like a legit hip hop festival. That's very cool. Oh, breeze of Vivid Shuffle. Promote it, right? Yeah, absolutely. Don't do it. You do it, man. You do it now. It's happening. It's good for uh, the whole dance scene. I think that uh, dance is the biggest scene in hip hop. Mein. Mm -hmm. Like it's more than uh, the whole rap scene. I think the dance scene is bigger. You're gonna be you're gonna be there on the finale? Yeah, I'm performing. Uh, plus, I went to tour bhi kiya, shuffle. Ke se. I went to the smaller cities. I went to Vizak. Uh, now I'm going to the more smaller cities. But where the hip hop scene hai ki nahi, pata bhi nahi hai. So yeah, wo hi chal raha. Bas, next, uh, I'm going to tour Breezer. Ke saath hi. Hmm. Jaisa tum kar de na. That's right. Uh, it's true. It's good. It's great tour. Like, he knows about it because he follows me on Instagram. Uh, handle is right here. Their Instagram handle is right there. Either, either. Either, either. Uh, the Facebook handle is right there. Yes. yes. Uh, the Twitter handle is right there. Yes. And uh, whoever is doing this on animation, make sure it's not there because it'd be damn funny. This <laughs> way. <laughs> <laughs> do you uh, also when you're performing? Mm -hmm. Do you bust a move? Oh yeah, of course. All Every, the time. Everything that I, all my music is based off of like my roots in classical dance. Like uh, we talked about this before too. That like classical rhythms is the same as like rapping. Like rapping is just lyrically speaking to a beat. And when we do like Raja Kumari Daughter of the King, how long do you think that you could keep up with my tempo? Dance to the rhythm, dance in the Himalay. Oh. So it's like. Uh, <laughs> So, uh, you've come to Bombay after a very long time and you came here for competitions, but uh, you're, the person you're staying with isn't like a regular person. Well, I, when I how? first came, yeah. When how? I, how did that happen? How? Music, just like how I met this guy through music. Um, he does music. Yeah, so does she. We're talking about Madhuri Dixit. That's why he's acting oh. like this. Oh. She no, lives with Madhuri No, I Dixit. don't now. The reason I came to Bombay and mm -hmm. the reason I felt so comfortable to stay is because I had wonderful get, like hosts that really made me feel comfortable in the city. I was with Madhuri working on her music project and I was working with Divine. So I had the best of both worlds kind of showing me the coolest parts of Bombay. So. If you would have met me, <laughs> I would have shown you some comedy gigs, yeah, well, then another comedy gig, <laughs> and then another comedy gig. <laughs> Till you're like, ah, that's it, thank that's you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, we, we were working on, um, it's going to come out soon, so I'm really excited. She finally announced it. So the when was this? Uh, recently, she announced that the, the music's coming out. But for the first six months, people would see pictures of me and her together, and I'd have to be like, oh, we're family friends. And then they'd be like, you guys look alike. I'm like, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Shared, really? <laughs> you know, whatever, I'd take like that. But she's, she's a wonderful, that's amazing awesome. artist. And anytime I look at her, I'm just in awe of the fact that she's just glowing like a goddess. We talked yeah. about this. I'm like, she's aging backwards. She's like... <laughs> she's the Benjamin Button. Yeah, and she's just <laughs> like, you know, she's so uh, committed. And then actually, it was kind of crazy. You and uh, Madhuri are from the same area. Yeah. So I always call them the legends of JB Nugger when they're, like, when they're together. Nice. Anyone here that. from JB Nugger? Anybody from JB Nugger? Okay, just you. <laughs> you and Madhuri, okay, so you're in good company. So, uh, so you're working with the track, uh, you're working on the entire album with Madhuri. She did a project, and I'll let her kind of tell you how extensive it goes, but uh, you know, it's fusion, it's really fun, and she's singing in English, so that's yeah. something. Awesome. Yeah, she I got a chance to hear some of it. You did? Mm. I was in the studio. Mein tha, jab log kaam kare tha. Yeah. Madhuri, I don't know if she's going to be Oh, when did you start rapping though? How, how old were you? So, I was 15. I was 27. I was last of the. So, oh, 
He's born on Gandhi Jayanti. You're born on Gandhi Jayanti? Huh. Nice, dude. Huh. The dry day. Right I have never given chocolate in school. I have never given a party in my friends. I have never given a party. This was planned. My father had planned it. So you started rapping in 15. Who introduced you to the form of art? I mean, the rap, 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 rap as an art. See, I am rapping. I have a little film, but in the end, I discovered a t-shirt in hip-hop. A girl had a t-shirt in school with 50 cents. I said, who is this? I'm looking full, dangerous, body, body. I used to use the Bollywood hero as well. Correct, yeah. So it was just, I was like, who is this? Then he gave me a CD, MP3 CD. It was like 65, 70 songs. Yeah, correct. So I had 70 songs, I had Tupac, Eminem, Nas, Kendrick, Lamar, Jay-Z, Kanye, 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 so I was running around in one CD, I was running around in my house and I was thinking, what are you saying? I didn't understand what I was saying. Because M&M, I don't know what I was saying. What are you saying? I don't understand what I was saying. Plus, there are also slangs included. So, I don't understand what I was saying. Just like this, they will understand what they are saying. So, I thought that there are also slangs in Hindi. If we are saying what we are saying in Hindi, if we are saying what we are saying in Hindi, and slang is a very big part of rap. Right, right, right. So, for this, it's such a good sound. If you like my music, then... I like it. Because of the slangs, because... What is the slang? Like, for example, like the slang, what would be an Indian slang? Like, public? Yeah. Public slang is not a word. It's public. It's a slang. It's a slang. Give me an example of a slang. What are you saying, public? What are you saying, public? It's a slang. It's like, huh? It's like, what's up? What's up? So, good. so that's how you realize the slangs. But when you used to listen to rap, you had you knew exactly what they were rapping about. Well, I I got a hip hop really early. Like my brother gave me the Fugees, the Score album, and I remember being so young. And I remember Lauren was like, uh, "Why you Al Capone? I'm defecating on the microphone." And I was like, "Why would a woman talk about shitting on a microphone?" And I was like, "What is this?" So I learned about hip hop through hip hop. I had to kind of like get it because I was too young when were I. Were you also like bootlegging CDs and listening to it? Like, yeah. I, I remember there used to be like uh, parental controls on it, and so yeah. I would always like your parents could listen to a little bit of it to like, prove it, and I would try to find the song that looked like it had the least bad words in it and let my mom listen to like 10 seconds. And then... You followed that through? I had to because I, I couldn't get the CDs any other way. So. Uh, ah, <laughs> yeah, how much life is your life? I started by... No, I wanted... Audio, 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 that's me. Yeah, we didn't have that. We didn't have that. Do you have a problem still if you're abused? Does your mom also have a problem if you're still abused? If you abuse oh, me, yeah, much. Sab pite wak, sab karte wak, sab video mein mere sab dikhta hai. Yeah. Meri maag pareshan ho ke khatam ho ke. Khatam ho ke. Pareshan hi khatam ho ke. Yeah. It was definitely, beginning I remember my dad didn't talk to me for like 10 days because, can I curse on this? Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, no, sorry. East to fuck! the yeah, okay. <laughs> I said East to the West, fuck with the best on one song. And my dad was like, what did you say? And he didn't talk to me for 10 days. But now my dad explains to people, oh, it's a character. She's playing a character. Oh, yeah. That's like how he's got around it's it. It's not a daughter Sweta. No, no, no. It's a Raja Kumari. She's a character. She smokes. She does all that stuff. Uh, the musical talent comes to you from dad, mom? My mom. Mom. Yeah. And for you? No. Can your mom rap? No. My family is going to be... Wait, I'm going to give you a little bit of a little bit. There's no music in music. No. Actually, my friends are more than my friends. Because I'm always going to grow up alone. I'm going to grow up alone. So, I'm going to grow up alone. Correct. I mean, CD to grandmother, because I'm going to listen to CDs. With my nanny and friends. So, nanny rap? Oh, they're going to listen to me and get it. Son, you have this CD of Tupac. Let's go, let's go. 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 Yes, he's fucked. Look, he's fucked. He's fucked. Hey, Nani, please make some fun. Hey. Am I an MC now? Yes. I'm trying my level best. What would... So, example, you guys... Hey, I've seen you a lot of rap. You're talking a little bit. Look, I've seen a lot of rap video. I've seen a lot of legend. Hey, I didn't see this. Yeah. Thank you. But you guys rap. I write jokes and put it in rhyme. Yeah, but that's also a part of rap. Comical rap. What are the other kind of... 
कर सकते हो तुम मुझे बोलता हो तुम भी हो It's called up rock. I, I feel I feel bad now. <laughs> this is on rent. This is on rent. That's on rent. This is on rent. Except for one article of clothing. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is on rent. So good. So I have a scope of dancing also. Do you think? Yeah. Zero. Zero. You you while I, while I was on call with you, you told me about the process that you had uh, while writing with Gwen Stefani. Mm. There, it's a very unique process because usually. When you write for an artist, I thought when you you know in America there's there's not that many huge albums that are released. So mm. usually it's like a collaborative effort with the top songwriters or producers in the time. I somehow got the invite in the room and I was just happy How to be the only. How is this somewhat Indian. happening to you? Air am on opportunity, right? Madhuri happened to you like yeah, that. Yeah, I don't know. God loves me. You got a you got a call. I got the call to see if I wanted to come to the session. Obviously, I was just like put my red lipstick on immediately. I was like, I'm there, um, and. You know, Gwen was going through a very public breakup at the time, and you know, we were there for her, and it was a form of therapy. And we talked about like, you know, she would write in her journal for like 30 minutes before the session, and she would come in with just whatever thoughts she had, and we would she would read them to us, and we'd pick like one sentence that was like really beautiful or deep, and then we would use that thought and start, you know, writing the song around it, and just write with her because. If her, if she writes a lyric and I write a lyric, mm. and we both can agree that we feel the same way about it, there's a better chance that more people will also be able to relate to the song. So yeah, you got away from a call, traffic cop because you proved that you are an artist. अगर प्रूव कर देंगे ना लोग तुमको ऐसे सरागों में बिठाएंगे बाइक. अगर बोल देंगे ना कि संगीतकार है, संगीतकार, संगीतकार आए, नहीं संगीतकार आए तो खत्म. माँ बोलो अच्छा लगता है कि यंग लड़का है कुछ करने की कोशिश कर रहा है फिर YouTube दिखाने का लोगों YouTube वालों को मालूम है अभी तो देख के देखते व्यूज भी अरे बहुत सही ये लेजिट है ये लेजिट है ये जा सकता है ब्लू चेक आई हैव अ क्वेश्चन टू यू गाइस सो अगेन सेम थिंग लाइक यू गाइस हैड मेट एंड एट द एनएसएम वीकेंड फेस्टिवल एट द ब्रिज स्टेज यू गाइस performed together half made song not a fully made yeah. song yeah yeah then you uh, after you went and performed on stage a half made song mm-hmm. did you know it had potential and that's when immediately you went in for it i mean we knew i mean when i first heard the track i already knew i wrote my verse in los angeles he wrote his verse in bombay and then when we we met we did the weekender but female log bahar nahi aa rahe the yaar to inko mila to mere ko aise laga ki it's the right thing to do is cuz more females will come out seeing yeah. her yeah, you know, absolutely. wo sabse zaruri hai and I, i i'm still waiting for that one female who just come out and ye to hai hi lekin aur come come yeah. bring it come bring it i bring it and then you put the video out which is out now yes who's jeep is it bhadega jaisa bhadega yes bhadega mere kapde jaisa jeep bhi bhadega Uh, what what are you working on next? Um, your um, album came out in 2016, which I yes. completely finished. Uh, my favorite track from that album has got to be Mira because oh, thank you. that song was like yeah, I can familiarize with the mm. the melody, but also the rap. That's my favorite song. That's the song. That's, that, that's, that's song? the one that let him yeah. uh, that he accepted me as an artist after. Oh, you know, it's that, because right? of. <laughs> 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 wow. Ooh, I'm drama. just kidding, drama. <laughs> no, I'm actually releasing the visual for yeah. Mira very soon. I have I just signed to Sony India, so I'm here. I'm like a. Committed awesome. to this region. Oh, thanks. Thank you, thank you, guys. Thank you. Um, yeah, so I'm committed to just like releasing some more fusion music. I mean, I'm having a lot of fun in India, so yeah. I just want to keep shooting videos out here and releasing more, you know, stuff. What about you? What are you working on next? Uh, I did some something for uh, with Nuclear for the new Anurag Kashyap movie, Mukabaz. Oh, My yeah. debut, Bollywood debut. Uh-huh. That's your Bollywood debut. Yeah. That's awesome, dude. That one we got in the trunk. No, no. Iske pehle studio mein bahut baar gaya main. Ha. Sab bade bade. स्टूडियो में गया लेकिन कुछ हुआ नहीं क्योंकि राइट स्पेस राइट गाना नहीं हाँ अनुराग न्यूक्लियर एंड मी और क्या चीज बट थैंक यू सो मच कमिंग 
The toilet paper. <laughs> toilet paper. Maggie noodles. Maggie noodles. Uh, Poppard. That's true. Bottled water. That's true. And uh, some kind of medicine. Ah, uh, it's genesis. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Yep. Yeah. yeah, thank you. Thank It'll you. become less medicine and probably replace the bottle of water consumption. Yeah, <laughs> Odomos, I need yes, that. Yes, because you yeah. know. I'm, I have the sweet California blood. They just, they know they I'm here. They just love the carbs out of you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and, uh, and for Divine, we've got for you uh, this poster. I mean, hey. uh, thank so you. Cool. This is what we are thinking your movie poster should look like. <laughs> Starring Divine. A Zoya Akta film presented by Tiger Baby Productions. <laughs> Straight out of the gully. Yes, yes. I love that. Thanks so much, man. Thanks, thank you. Thank you so much for coming out of the show. And now, for no reason at all, unnecessary rhymes. Beta, you are a you want your son to marry a girl who's brown From your hometown, also Brahmin But he said he's in love with a man So you'll hang yourself from which fan? It's coming from the city slum slums City slum slums City slum slums Yeah, I hear He was about to do it Yeah, with the mic, who's in it? Who's in it? सड़क जबानी चाह में पानी हाथ में कार गारी ना काब खाली भारी थाली सर पे जिम्मेदारी एक ही तो मालिक बाकी कुछ दिन वाले कर्मचारी काए का बीफ तू इस रैप खेल में शाकाहारी बहुत जाली Awesome, it's time for us to move on to the game. But before that, I thought like अभी शेके लिल डीले लिल डीले लिल डीले I like that name. I'm saying young Dravidian. Young Dravidian, okay. That's a good one. I'm coming to the delay. I'm coming to the delay. I'm coming to the delay. I like Lil Dravidian. I like Lil Delay. So I think Delay Dravidian. Ah, DD. Yeah, you got it. DD, right? That's what I'm talking about. Till the time it's not MC. It's all good. All right, we're about to play a game called Volley Balloon. Where we basically use a balloon to play badminton. The catch is not to catch the balloon. You have to use anything other than your hand. And with three touches, you have to make sure that you play the game. If it falls down, or if you use your hand, you're gonna get scored in minus. Okay. So we play a few rounds and let's see who wins. All right, good. So are you guys ready to play volley balloon? Yeah. Also, awesome. make some noise. Okay, let's see how this goes. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait. I can. Are you ready? Okay, okay. Okay. I have the net. I am the net. And go. Oh, done. Uh, nice. Ah, this looks like a beach day. <laughs> Whoa! Wow, that's nice. <laughs> Divine got two touches in this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Three, go, Divine, go, 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 it's still yours. Go, <laughs> that's still yours. Ah, 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 shit. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, 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 that's nice, Divine. You have to get that. Yes, go. Ah, oh, ladies and gentlemen, Divine gets point number one. Now, go. Done. That's uh, uh, one. Uh, 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 uh. Woo! That's two. You get one more to go. And that's three. Right down. Slammed. Wow. That's like a smash by Divine. Two. Two, two, two. Great. That's that's one. <laughs> two. Yeah, we're cheating. Yeah, they. Yeah, shit. This is my touch. This is my touch. No, no. Okay, she gets a point. I get to decide. I don't know. <laughs> it's not like I'm favoring. Uh, and this is the last round, so let's check who gets the final point. And your time starts now. Go! Uh, it's, it's, uh. <laughs> hey, ah! ah! No, 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 no! You weren't supposed to use that! Hey, yo! Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to release the spring on you. Hello! You know. Oh, we have the winner! We have the winner of uh, yes. Volley Balloon, and uh, ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for Divine for winning this one. Please give it all you got for Ms. Roger Kumari. That brings us to the end of another episode. Please say hi to your auntie. This is bye from Abish. Sayonara, arigato, mama goto. I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Yeah, give me a rap. That's it's full of. And now, for no reason at all, unnecessary rhymes. Papa, mommy, send me to grad school in the US or the UK because it's cool. You'll take a giant loan and live in debt. The next time you see me is when one of you is dead. <laughs>